Welcome to another episode of Quick Tech Tips and Reviews. My name is Tony, and with this channel, I'm always trying to bring you guys a variety of different tech-related content. So, if this is your first time here, consider subscribing, and if you do, hit that little bell down below as well so that you know when I'm going to release new content. In today's video, we're going to take a look at forwarding multiple ports and a range of ports on an edge router using just one rule. All right, guys, today's video is going to be short and quick just to answer a few inquiries I've had regarding forwarding multiple ports on an edge router using one rule and forwarding a range of ports. So we're going to take a look at that right now. I'm signed into my edge router. I'm on the firewall NAT tab and I'm in the port forwarding sub tab. I set up a couple of basic port forwarding rules. Now, if you're interested in learning more about port forwarding, I've done a video on that and I'll put the link to that video up above. But today we're just gonna focus on multiple ports forwarded and a range of ports. <coughs> Excuse me. So if you look here, I have two basic rules set up. We're gonna forward port 443 to an internal server to the forward port of 443. And the same thing with port 10443, we're gonna forward that internally to port 443. Now, you see it's done in two rules here, but what we can do is combine that down into one rule simply by going into the first rule and separating the first port, original port with a comma, and then adding the second port. And then we can go ahead and remove this rule here and apply. And once the uh, configuration has been applied by the edge router, we in effect have the same thing as we had with the two rules. Now we're forwarding both original ports 443 and 10443 to the internal server to the forward port of 443. It's that simple. Now, quick tip. If you look and you see these little information icons, if you hover over them, they give you some guidance on what can and what cannot be done. So if you're not sure and you see these little icons, these little information um, circles in the edge router interface, hover over them. They might be able to offer you some help. So it's that simple to forward multiple ports on an edge router just using one rule. Just separate those ports numbers by using commas. Now for a port range, it's equally as simple. Let's just say we wanted to forward a random range of uh, 1000 to 2000. So we put in, in the original port field 1000 separated by a hyphen and then the second port range and then here you have the option of leaving this blank and if you don't set the uh, port information here it will just pick up the port information from the original port and apply it and you can see it says that right here forward packets to this port if not set original port information will be used but for the purpose of this video i'm going to put in the range and then go ahead and apply the rule And once the rule is applied by the edge router, you now have the range of ports from 1000 all the way up to 2000 being forwarded on the edge router using just one rule. So really quick, really simple, how to forward multiple ports using one rule and how to forward a range of ports using just one rule. I hope you found this video helpful and I hope I answered the questions of those viewers on how to accomplish this. And if you guys did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to check out some of my other videos up above. Please remember to subscribe, like, and share, and use those Amazon affiliate links. I know it doesn't change your price, but it surely helps out the channel. My name is Tony with Quick Tech Solutions. As always, I thank you guys for watching and see you next time.